And that's all for now. I hope you all enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Um, Tom? I warned the villagers of the unauthorized boat like you asked. Tom? Hmm. Mm -mm. Huh? Um, Tom? Sweetie, put that down, please! Tom? Tom? It's alright, Isabel. I got this. Listen, Tom! If you're that upset, you don't have to deal with this! We can... we can send a rep to tell him to leave. You don't have to see him. It's all right. I just want to talk to him. Then put down the shovel. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Be careful. Hmm. <sighs> I've never seen him this angry before. <sighs> Hi, Tom. There you are. Tom! Yeah. Buddy! Pal! Friend! Mm. Uh... Hey! How's it going? I was just passing through. Enough of that. Huh? Step outside. We need to talk. Right now. Oh, sure thing. So, you're selling art now? Yeah, it's in high demand, you know. Met a real nice kid, too. Uh-huh. That painting you sold my representative looked an awful lot like the Mona Lisa. So, either you forged art, or you stole the actual Mona Lisa. And if I'm being honest, I could believe both of those possibilities from someone like you. Well, I'm flattered. Nah, I just got it from some guy. Real trustworthy. Red, you just sold my representative fake art. You actually just scammed another of my friends. It's been years since I've seen you, and this is how you greet me? I'm thoroughly disappointed. <sighs> In fact, I'm more than disappointed. I'm angry. So congratulations, you managed to upset me. Is that why you came here? To get back at me for leaving? All right, all right. So, I may have sold her art, but I'm just trying to survive. I bought this boat, and now I'm broke. I had to sell everything. And she's the one who waltzed into a stranger's boat and bought art, thinking it was the real thing. Kind of silly if you ask me. And now you're telling me my representative is dumb. Not dumb. Gullible. People like her are how I've survived for so long. It's just what I have to do. What you have to do? 
Listen, back then you were doing the same thing. We're not all that different, really. Now you just ask people directly for money. I'm just adding a little artistic flair to it. My job's about give and take, but you, not so much. You're just a greedy businessman now. At least I'm giving something back, and you call me a thief. Well, you can call me that all you want, but the way I see it, your name might as well be Tom Crook. You know what, Red? I suppose I am. When you look at it, all I've done is just take the bells of everyone I come across. But you know what? There's something special about you, Red. You come and go as you please, and then you're just... gone. Like nothing happened. I shouldn't be giving someone special treatment. Anyone who comes here should have to pay. I can't keep letting you off of the hook, Red. So I finally decided. What's that? Rents do. Um, I don't know how to tell you this, but this is forged. What? It's a fake. See, the real Mona Lisa doesn't have eyebrows. You really must be careful buying things from shifty strangers. Mm. I, I'm terribly sorry. Uh, hey, are you interested in fine art? Because I have just... I gotta go. You might catch me, but I'm gonna make at least one more deal before you do. I don't know where all that confidence came from, but I'm gonna beat it out of you. What happened to talking? You're gonna scare your butts! Nah, uh, they know I wouldn't do this without a good reason. Whoever got me this riled up must be a real piece of work. Okay, but this is not fair! Oh god, oh jeez! I want my money, Red. Hmm. How? Lots of fruit. What? All right, time to die. Hey, can we just talk about this? <laughs> 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 oh, jeez, you okay? Uh, <laughs> All right, fine. <laughs> you know what? I don't want your dang money. I don't know where that stuff's been. Yeah, not like getting my money! You got more than you know what to do with! Well, more than you, that's for sure. <laughs> Ugh, did you just... Oh, you're dead. You know, you keep on saying that, but... <laughs> Get <laughs> off! <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Isabel? Yes? Tom and the, uh, fox from the boat are, uh, fighting. Wait, you mean like yelling at each other, right? <laughs> no, they were really going at it. I got scared. <sighs> I'll take care of this. Where are they? Uh, in the cedar forest, near Nook's Cranny. Got it! Wait, I'm coming too! Hey! Stop it! No! I can't believe you two! Fighting like this! There are kids here! Who started it, huh? Uh, I mean, I guess I hit him first. He's the one who started chasing me with a shovel! I told you to put down the shovel! <sighs> what made you two fight like this? Uh-uh. Huh? <laughs> if it's personal, I won't pry. But I don't want you two starting a fight like this again. Got it? Fine. Not like it was on my agenda. As for you, I know you're aware by now. But whatever you did made Tom very upset. I've never seen him like this. The fact that he picked a fight with you proves my point. And the fact that you fought back so recklessly means you were hurt by whatever happened as well. So I hope you both got the worst of it out of your systems. Now, either you talk this out with Tom, or you can leave. Your choice. Hmm. Why did you come here? I was fine. Like I said, I was just passing through. You and I both know that's not true. Can't you just tell the truth for once? Huh? You're still angry because I left back then. I left to focus on my own business. I didn't want to just scrape by anymore. I'm making good, fair money now. I was happy. And you hate that. You just had to come back and ruin it. Are you happy now? You made a few bells selling fake art. On an island I spent millions to get. Anyway... I think I'll be fine. Things are good here. I've met some good people. My life isn't over just because you showed up and caused a bit of trouble. You know? That's just great. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll just uh, be on my way. Huh? Man, you two sure fought rough. Are those bite marks? That is feral! Tom, are you okay? Not really, no. Come on, let's go back to the plaza. Any better? Yes. Good. You know I'll be up all night worried, Tom. You don't have to tell me everything. I just want to know what made you snap like that. I know I said I won't pry, but I do think you'd feel better talking with someone. 
Could you tell me a little of what happened at least? Please? All right, but it's not all that interesting. So, Red and I used to work together. Uh -huh. It went well for a while. Here's my idea. But soon I realized that we just didn't see eye to eye on how business should be done. Red's proposals were always so risky. Uh -huh. And he made a lot of enemies of the higher-ups. That made it hard to start my own business, even if I wanted to. Even my friend wouldn't hire me, because he knew I was with Red. So at that point, it was either Red hey! or a stable job. And I was ready for a change. But he wasn't. I wanted to trust him. Oh, come but on, I just couldn't afford to. Oh, come on, it'll he be wasn't okay. paying me back. For anything. All he had was empty promises. I just... I hate that he was one of the first people I opened up to. I didn't care that he was a fraud back then. I was just glad that he wanted to... help me. And now that I've seen him again, I know that... he's the one who really needs help. But I don't want to be the one to do it. Why should I? He just scammed peeps out of their hard-earned bells. Just to get back at me. He came all the way out here. Just to scam my residents. <sighs> I can't believe him. Everywhere I went, he was there. Skulking around, conning my customers. I thought I'd finally gotten away from him on this island. But no. He's a stubborn, leeching, dishonest pain in my side. To think I used to be inspired by him. But I guess this was bound to happen eventually. We were both conmen after all. So, he was your first friend. It makes a bit more sense now. I never thought he could get to me this easily. It's been years since I seen him. I thought it was over it. But... <sighs> How could I act so childishly? After all this time. Why couldn't I keep it together? I'm supposed to be better than this. Oh boy! I hope it's anything but another tire. I'll even take another black bass. When did... who... She kept the shovel. <laughs> 